Learn VR MR. Come to the Spatial XR community. Next, I'll demonstrate how to detect if a button is being touched. Previously, we focused on pressing a button, but detecting button touches is also possible. Let's open the input configuration file again and create a new action. Naming it test touch Y. This time, I want to detect if the Y button on the left controller is being touched. The action type will still be button. When binding, Expand XR controller, select XR controller, left hand, and then open usages. The Y button on the left controller and the B button on the right controller are both represented by secondary button. But we want to detect if the Y button on the left controller is being touched, not pressed. To achieve this, select Secondary Touch instead. Generally, if you want to detect whether a button is being touched, the button's name will usually have a touch suffix. Now, the button input has been successfully bound to the action. Next, we'll open the script. The process remains the same. I'll quickly write the code, okay. Here I'll provide the complete code. A variable is defined, and a method is bound to the action when it is triggered. When we touch the Y button on the left controller, this line of code will be output. Back in Unity, assign the corresponding action to the variable we just created. Which is test touch Y. After running the program, I'll try touching the Y button on the left controller by gently placing my finger on the button. At this point, the console outputs the message, indicating that the system successfully detected me touching the Y button on the left controller. When I press the Y button on the left controller, there is no output because we bound the touch action not the press action. The message will only be displayed again when I touch the button. This confirms that the touch detection logic for the Y button on the left controller is working correctly. Next, I'll demonstrate how to detect touches on the joystick button of the right controller. In the input configuration file, create a new action named test duke right dots and set the action type to button. In the path section, first locate right hand. Then expand usages. Scroll down and you'll see primary to Daxis. Click on it. This input represents touching the joystick button on the right controller. Next, we'll edit the script and write the code using the same approach as before. Normally, when I touch the joystick button on the right controller, this line of text will be output. 
Back in Unity, reference this action and and run the program. Then I'll touch the joystick on the right controller and the console will output this message proving that the touch button binding works correctly.